Good morning, everybody. It is Wednesday, May, I don't know what, maybe May 8th or something. But let me tell y'all a quick, quick little story about the trip for today. So, my plan, as I said last night on TikTok and YouTube, TikTok may have missed it because TikTok ended up in ending my live and banning my live. But let me tell y'all the reason the plans have changed. We were going to go to the Cape Coast Castle, a.k.a. the dungeon. We were going to go to see the alligators, where you can pet the alligators and feed them. Y'all have seen me feed them and bait them out the water and things like that. But they were in mating season, so they wouldn't come onto the land. But these alligators walk amongst the people and have been doing so for 40 years. And doing all of my research before I went to see them, they have never attacked anyone. And then when I finally got there and spoke with the man, he said as well, they have never attacked anyone. So here's how the plans change. We, we, we will not be going to the alligators today. We will not be going to see the alligators today. As I ended my live last night, at, this was this will be posted on both platforms. As I ended my live last night, I clicked in and the timer stopped. And so I'm assuming my live stopped, but I noticed that people are still commenting. So I'm thinking, can they still hear me talking? Cause I'm, my live is ended. I'm finna talk to my husband or just go on with my life until the, the, the live uploads. So I mute my mic and turn off my camera. And I see three comments and they were basically saying like, good night, Miss Kimberly or something like that. You know, some praying hands or something. And I see one last comment. I don't know the girl's name. I, I hate I didn't write her name down. I blocked her, but I went back and found her picture and unblocked her because I wanted her to come on here today. So her comment was, Something to the effect of, ha ha, we finally get to see you get eaten by a crocodile. Laughing out loud. So I look at the comment and I go back to try to find it because it disappeared. And I touch it and it keeps disappearing. So I finally get it to stay and I read it. And sure enough, she's saying, again, something to the effect of, ha ha, I remember this part for sure. We finally get to see you get eaten by a crocodile. Bitch, you will never put, you put that into the energy, to the atmosphere. You put that out into the universe that you're going to see me get eaten by a crocodile. Now, y'all might think that that's petty or Kimberly don't pay that no attention, but no, 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 no. I don't believe in that. I believe that you can put things into the atmosphere and it will happen. You can create your own reality. And so why a person would joke like that or say that for any reason whatsoever, I don't know. I didn't think it was funny. Um, she had already made a couple comments that I was kind of skeptical about, but just kind of brushed past it. So because she made that statement, we will not be going to the crocodiles today whatsoever i will probably never go back to the crocodiles maybe blacko will take y'all one day or something like that but um i don't know who this lady is she could be somebody right here in ghana that put some juju on me she could be somebody in america she could be anywhere in the universe hating me disliking me and praying that i go to the crocodiles and get eaten up she could be a person that's doing that so, ma'am, sir, it won't happen today. Unless a crocodile come along here and find me, I won't be taking myself to the crocodiles. So your wish and your prayer will not be granted today in the name of God. It will not be, okay? So, we will, we, we, we will be skipping that. And the crocodiles is not far from me. The crocodiles are very, very, they're close enough to my house. To, it doesn't cost me much for the driver. Now, it does cost me a lot for the driver to go to Cape Coast to the dungeon. But that's canceled because my TikTok money ain't looking right. So we probably won't go to the castle. I'm just going to kind of wait and figure out what the driver is going to charge me. We may still go there. We may not. Um, 
because my focus right now is like I'm not even shopping for food today literally I'm at a place right now where I'm so ready to go home and I'm saving my money that I'm buying minimal stuff like I might buy beans and rice to eat until next Wednesday's paycheck I'm not spending nothing I don't have to spend because I don't have it and my focus is to save my money and get out of here have money to travel with have money to have when I get to where I'm going and then anything can happen the airplane could have a a 24-hour delay and what I'm gonna do I have to have some type of money so alligators I mean the crocodile is done the Cape Coast um, once the driver uh, comes he's here but he's here but um, he he went he went in there and fell asleep black oh so when he gets up I'll see what he's gonna charge me to take me to Cape Coast and um, depending on that charge we will we might go to the Cape Coast dungeon and then come on back home but I think it's really sad that you have people on here grown people on here stupid enough sad enough ignorant enough miserable enough lonely enough and hateful enough to project their bullshit onto other people innocent people because I don't know you I ain't never done nothing to you but I unblocked you I unblocked you because I want you to come back I want to see what you got to say today I want to hear you say oh it was just a joke I would never wish that on you Kimberly or I want to see you come back and just be quiet if you're just going to be silent out of shame or if you're going to come back talking shit. Either way, I unblocked you. But um, as soon as um, we get ready to go, I will uh, let y'all know ahead of time that we're leaving. Well, no, I won't. Just be prepared. In the next hour, we will be leaving to go somewhere. Either I'm going to go to Cape Coast or I'm going to go into the local market. And just grab a couple things to eat. Like I said, I might grab some rice and beans and potatoes, something like that. And um, I'll worry about getting my luggage uh, next week. Tashani, I'm so sorry. I saw your comment this morning that said, how can we donate to get you a luggage? I didn't see the comment last night. I was trying to go from YouTube to TikTok and back and forth and missed it. But I did see your super chat. I appreciate that and thank you. I appreciate all the super stickers and super chats and super thanks. So y'all will hear from me soon. I love you all and stay blessed.